Hi, it's Pamela. In this tutorial, we're going to add and animate a signature in Doodly. Hey, and welcome to the official Doodly YouTube channel. If you enjoy our content, please click the like and subscribe button below. Now let's get straight to the video. Have you ever wanted to add a signature to your Doodly whiteboard videos? Perhaps you need a generic signature to place on an image of a contract. Or maybe you'd like to add your own signature under your profile picture at the end of a video to make it more personalized. Whatever the case may be, adding a signature is quite easy. As you'll see here, I have my signature on a little scroll image and it is transparent, okay? And that's going to be very important. For example, I have the same signature that I uploaded without transparency and see the problem. It's got the white surrounding it and that just doesn't have the same effect. Now this would be fine in some instances if you're just placing it on a pure whiteboard, but it's not fine when you're putting it on top of something else. So what I wanna recommend is that you use a tool that removes the background and then upload your image as a PNG file. Now we've gone over this in previous videos, the difference between PNG and JPEG. And if you're not familiar with that, I recommend taking a look at that video. So how, what's an easy way to do it if you don't have Photoshop or Illustrator or something like that? Well, there's a program called remove.bg that will remove your background for you instantly. It's great. So I'm gonna show you the process using my iPhone and a piece of paper and a pen. It's really simple. Start with a white piece of paper and a black pen. Go ahead and sign your name. Now head over to remove.bg and click upload image. Take photo. And now you're gonna take a picture of the signature you just did. Remove.bg will upload it and automatically remove the background. Now click download. Download once again. And then use your phone's share extension and preferred sharing method to send it over to your computer. So once you've created that signature file, all you need to do is bring it into Doodly. So it's just the same process that we always do. You go to props, you go to the blue plus sign, you browse for your file, and you upload it. So once you have the signature file in place, you're gonna want to customize the drawing paths because otherwise it's just gonna scribble on and it's not gonna make a lot of sense. For example, let's just take a quick preview. And it just scribbles on. That's not the way I sign my name. I don't just scribble it on like that. Well, maybe I do kind of scribble it, but. It, I want the ink to come out of the pen in the proper shapes, right? So let's go ahead and take care of that now. So you select your signature, click the little pencil icon, and you're now into this little customizing drawing path mode. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to create my drawing paths in the exact manner that I create my signature. So I always start with the P like this and I go down. Now, I like to zoom in a little so I can see it better, and I do like to adjust the path size. So, now that I've done that, I can do some fine tuning. And now I'll do a new path. And I'm just following how I normally sign my name. If you're signing somebody else's name, you know, say it's a fictional character, then, you know, just do it the regular cursive way that you normally would um, just write in cursive, right? So just do it like that and it'll look so much more realistic. And with the signature, it doesn't take any time at all to make this. As you can see, it's moving quite quickly. Go ahead and click Save and Return. And now let's preview it and we'll be done. Doesn't that look much nicer than the scribble? And that's the basics of adding and animating a signature in Diddly. Thanks for watching.